This is Uncle Mark in the Mothership with some Stormy Monday Blues jams. The jams. So I got a loop going on here on my three string cigar box guitar. I got a loop going on down in my uh, pedal. So I'm just going to start. You know the song by now. You've seen the lesson. It's an A. A is here. whole bunch of different little tricks um, so I have a lesson on playing like this and it's called left hand technique and it's your technique for your left hand and it starts out with things like this and it ends up and that 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 whole lesson uh, schedule uh, 10 lessons it's all ends up in G but you know a is here a is here Okay, so G, G sharp, A, B flat, B, C, C sharp, D, D sharp, E, F, F sharp, G, G sharp, A, B flat, B, okay, so on and so on and so forth. You end up here on F. Um, that's my guitar. Some guitars end up on E, right? So it depends on what you got going for yourself, but you definitely can get to A, okay? So what I'm doing here is I'm playing in little pockets, okay? And it's called a blues box. So you got a blues box here. You got a blues box here. You got a blues box up here. Okay? So that's how I work what I'm doing. I work my way up from the bottom and then go back down. So in here, this is my A note. I'm on my D string on my seventh fret. My C works as well. My D works. And when I do this, I'm kind of bending my wrist as opposed to wiggling it with my finger. And you'll see my arm move this way because it's a whole bunch of wrist action. So all these notes work. You could create an entire solo out of those four notes, like so. So what I'm doing here is just a hammer-on. So I'm playing, plucking one time. So. 
And a lot of times I come back with my pick, so bam, bam. Sometimes I go forward. Um, that's called pick attack. It depends on what you want. When you play all the notes in your blues box, it's called playing chromatically. This note does not work in this specific application, but as long as you're going to here, it works. So, you know, if you are playing here on this G, G sharp doesn't work, as, but if you're going to A, it does. So I'm gonna play chromatically now through here with this little looper. So you can play chromatically. Also, you can reach these notes by bending the string prior to it up. Instead of hitting this note, you can... So you can play that way as well. That, that's a trick I learned uh, watching Jerry Garcia of The Grateful Dead. He would... cool little trick. I mean, I'm sure other guys have done it, but that's who I learned it from by watching some live Grateful Dead, watching Jerry just kind of make notes that, that don't quite make it. Um, your next blues box is up here, G, um, G, A, D, E, G, uh, A. So you work here, slide up. So you can slide from this blues box up to this blues box. So get your hand used to going from five to 12. That's a good place to go. Um, another note that works in this blues box is this one. This is a... Uh, a, B, and you can cry up to this. And if you notice, I'm hitting the same notes, I'm just attacking them different. that C works in this blues box, right? So this C works. So all these notes work. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay? So I can fool around with these six notes and go... And that's all I'm doing here is working around these two blues boxes. And this is a trick that's in my left hand technique, this... It's in my left hand technique, all those little tricks, you know, so you can... Thank mm -hmm. you. 
So those are little tricks you can learn. Um, the hammer on. And the other one. They are in my left hand technique lesson. So uh, take a look at that. Just remember that lesson is for in G. But you know, everything in G can be moved up to A just by doing this. It, it is that simple, right? G, A. So for you more advanced players that want to solo through these songs, this would be the way to do it. Um, so this is Uncle Mark and the Mothership. Um, I do have a fretless lesson coming up exactly next. So uh, I'll show you how to fool around with your fretless. Um, and for those asking, this is signed by John Anderson. That was his signature. So thank you so much. And uh, we'll see you. I uh, do have a link down below. It's a paypal.me forward slash Uncle Mark Tips. Thank you so much for your donations. Thank you for all your support, social media, sharing, all of those things. Thanks a lot, guys.